we're delighted to have you joined us for this special screening of the movie Bully. Co-sponsoring this evening's event is the American Federation of Teachers, AFT, along with NEA, and we are just two of the organizations that are community partners supporting the movie Bully, and especially their outreach effort. This is what we should be doing. This is what the community of educators should be doing about children. And what this represents tonight is our mutual and collective values to ensure that we keep our children safe. This movie is devastating and compelling, and it needs to be seen. And it's an honor for us as EAFT to be screening it with all of you tonight. Thank you very, very much. Uh, I am so full of hope today. I am so full of hope that our nation is ready to turn the corner on bullying. I truly believe that. I think for two years, we have been hearing about tragedy. We have been mourning. We have been grieving. And we cannot ignore the fact that those tragedies are continuing. But I think now is the time to turn the corner to empower our youth, our educators, our leaders, to give them the tools. And I think it's the youth in America that are stepping up and saying, we want to change this narrative. We want to be the generation. We want to be the generation that rises up and puts bullying in our rear view mirror. We have an opportunity to reach millions across the country. Thank you so, so much for coming out today. Uh, this is an incredible honor. Uh, to have the union standing together to support this film is a dream come true. And uh, I really look forward to where we take the conversation from here. So thank you so, so much. I actually think that parents don't have the resources to be excellent advocates. Part of what we've been working to build is um, powerful resources so that parents can have effective and, and powerful communications with the school so that it's clear, so that the communication is documented, so that they understand what their rights are. I think that there's still a lot of work to be done, actually. I think we have to actually make these kind of issues real for people and to say it's okay to be out, it's okay to be different, it's okay and the adults around kids have to make it okay for kids. What was amazing about the movie for me was that Lee and the kids and parents told an amazing story that I think can catalyze a different set of behaviors. No, we know that that bullying is an epidemic in, in schools. But for kids with special needs, it's a, a pandemic. You know, two out of 10 young people report being bullied. Six out of 10 students with disabilities report being bullied. So it's, you know, having those supports, having the personnel there, but also having them prepared and trained in the right way is absolutely critical. I'm a parent of a child who was bullied. And it just seems to me that some of this is really character and common sense. That when a child is made fun of as an adult, as a responsible adult, you say this isn't right. Every child deserves respect. Part of what we need to do is have both the awareness that this is not right. And there are real consequences, a real human toll to people when they get bullied. That it's not a rite of passage. That's number one. And number two, there's a series of interventions that we have to do, both in terms of empowering people who've been bullied and also finding ways to educate people who are, who are the bulliers. So there's a series of interventions, there's a lot of education, and there's a climate change that can happen, but 
We have to create the stories and the awareness. One of the things that's just wrong is that we don't deal with it as a culture in the school. There need to be teams of people, whether they're psychologists or specialists, but any group of adults who then can talk about what do you see? Who do you see that's being bullied or picked on? What is, it, what is our strategy together to change the culture of the building? I honestly believe that can be done. I think it can be done when people come together to do that. And I mean, wouldn't it be great if a year from now, if we all gathered here and we talked about how much difference this movie and interventions had been to change that culture. James Wendor, Randy Weingarten, Katie Butler, Jackie Libby, Lee Hirsch, terrific film. Uh, thank you all for, for being here.